Hi everyone, John here for JPWHU TV. As you may have read earlier today, I've got to try and keep this as short as possible because I'm taking a quick cheeky break. Um, that the Maxi Gomez deal has gone south. I've been saying it for weeks, ever since this story came out, I've been saying it, it's not going to happen and it's now officially, well not unoff it's not official, but it's basically not going to happen. Uh, the reason being is because we don't want to pay the money by the looks of it. So, but he does not want to come to the Premier League. He does not um, for a team that doesn't play Champions League football. He wants to stay in Spain, etc., etc. You, you guys, you know all, all the circumstances surrounding it. But it's not just that, okay? Because obviously, the one of the reported links was Mitrovic, who signed for Fulham a few days ago, um, which is great. You know, he extended his contract. He will do very well down in the Championship once again. Um, we've also losing out to uh, losing Sabellos to Spurs, but from what I understand as well, we're losing out on that midfielder. But I don't really think he's a player that we should, we need to be bringing in. Uh, we have all, we're also missing out on um, Solomon Rondon because apparently the club don't want to hit their 16 and a half million uh, release clause that West Brom have put in. So again, options running thin and with a month left to go on the transfer window, guys. Let me know your thoughts on it. I want to know who you who you want to bring in. Before I don't mention Balotelli because Balotelli is not an option in any shape or form. Um, he's, he's Pellegrini basically wants to have a reliable player that he wants to play for the team and not for himself, which is one of the other reasons why we got rid of Anatovic. Um, as obviously that was confirmed yesterday officially that he went in the most funniest of circumstances, which we will talk about tomorrow. Um, talking of which, we've the, there's a podcast coming up tomorrow in the evening at half seven with the Ulster Hammer, as his Twitter handle is, um, talking about his love of West Ham, how he got into the club. Guys, you know the normal questions I ask everybody. Um, if anybody wants to help me out with the website that's starting up, if anybody wants any blogs, as, if, sorry, is anyone able to write any blogs, get in touch. If you guys want to put any video content together, again, get in touch. Email address contact at jpwhutv.co.uk. Um, as I say, I will explain more tomorrow evening. But as I say, in the meantime, guys, let me know what your thoughts are on on these on these stories. You know, do you agree that we've we've pulled out the Gomez deal? Should we've tried more? By the looks of it, it looks like we've tried everything else that's possible. So, guys, let me know your thoughts on this. And in the in the meantime, I will obviously any questions put them in down in the comments, and I will read them out tomorrow. They say jump on the live chat at half seven tomorrow evening, where where me and Ben, the Ulster Hammer, we talk we'll be talking. So, any questions you've got for this normal supporter? then by all means get in touch if you've got any questions you want me to answer on there get, again get in touch on the live chat tomorrow or put your comments in the comment section below so i'll see you guys tomorrow all the best